Welcome back, Japan Cycle Cup. Let's get into the race. Let me just share the stream with the people here. PCM game sim single player one off race. Japan Cycle Cup is a one point pro Japan Cycle Race Stardust. Favorites for the race Kovi, Albanese, Volta, Corbin, Strong, Formolo, Nealands. Parada, Pesha, Fogelsang, and Eon Zigeta. Oh well, whatever people are pinged. Japan start list. Oops, apologies, my riders need to slow down and get the hell out of the pack. Not every, not everyone. Japan Cup, what's happening at the start? The Mega Nailed is attacked of Team Ro Rube and Selby of Bengal. Colorado of Beat, Wenzel of Leopard and Bidart of CIC. There we are, my riders have abandoned. Excellent work. Some big teams here, a lot of leaves on the side of the road. There you go, Breaker 5 has got away two minutes up the road. Selby of Team Bingo, Megan out of Roubaix, Colorado of Beat, Winsell of Leopard, and CI has been a beard out of CIC. Got a crash already, but they're up already. They're up, that's good. Zara and Verstrange. It's raining a little bit, you can't quite tell that it's raining.
Four by Corbin Strong and Jose Harada. Jose Harada has been dropped out the back. Corbin Strong is back in the pack though. Still early days in this circuit race. So Jose Harada is now back in the peloton. few laps of this race occurring. Front of the peloton is Iolo, Saint Mikel, Tudor, Kofidis, GW Shimano and Israel Premier Tech. But mostly we have a lot of GW Shimano here at the front. Decent points up for grabs here. A lot of teams like absolute like Tatu has said ready for some promotions. For the pack, James Knox of Roubaix is on the ground, he's back on his bike though, and Simon of, I'm going to say, Ifepel. Yes, there's also a result on the ground, but he is up and back in the pack. 100 kilometers to go. Oh, splits in the peloton. There's a fall which caused some of it, but the rest of it is by something else. A few riders. Mertz is on the ground. James Knox is on the ground once again for Team Roubaix. Jensen, Breholz, Grat and Rubit are behind. No one's coming back for James Knox. Is Roubaix setting their sights on a different leader? Tuesday, apparently. No, no, let's see. I see. My mistake. French team, French team, French team. I have got James Knox, but they're letting him work for himself to get back in with the Mertz instead of riding together. The break still is three minutes after all these catastrophic moments. Team Tudor now has got Brun on the front with Gomez. There we are. Knox is back in the pack. Will we see some splits on the descent? Quite possibly. To rise off the back would be Knox again, is it? No. It is De Kock and Borgogna from CIC and Leopard. They're just not able, able to hold on up the climbs. Sadly for them, it's quite a hilly race. Stefano Museo at the back, grabbing some water for his team. of has fallen there's another crash I swear this isn't totally abandoned but another crash Rory Oliveira as well Sean Flynn Extempera Ben Zinix and De Cox still at the back two riders from Glass Drive their new manager will not be too pleased
breakaway still working nicely together. Looks like around what's that? They fresh up the hill. They do, but not the big hill. One, two, three, four, five, six. About six, seven-ish laps to go. Seventy k's. So about ten k's a lap. Four by burst range of Team Rubey. He is abandoning. Luckily, this is one of the last races of the season. Unlucky for his manager. Losing another rider. Christensen is out behind. Oh, who's come back? Looks like the human powered health boys have come back for their leader. Attack by uh, Luis Leon Sanchez from the Peloton. It is followed by Van Itvelt of Team Lotto Destiny. Gomez is just dragging the peloton back up to them. Their attack will hopefully get some ground. But let's see. Helping Gomez on the front is Critter from Team Coffitus. There's about 15 seconds to the attackers. But Brun for Tudor is now on the front. At the back of the peloton, a few splits are forming. Riders unable to keep up with the pace. Oh my god, where the fuck is Israel? Right here. Okay. Benitzvelt looking a bit dead as he climbs the hill. Brun, will he catch up? Run will catch up to Van Eetveld. Luis Leon Sanchez, though, out in front, his last year as a professional. There's an attack from inside the peloton. Crater is going. Franchillo and the Gomez. Maybe they're just working hard, actually. More splits at the back. As riders cannot keep up with such with the, the quick pace. There's a fall in E2 by Venzel. Wenzel has been dropped from the breakaway with his crash, but he is up. And he's still ahead of the... Oh, a big crash in the peloton. Squeegins is down. Dombrowski, Formolo. Let's have a look and see if anyone's really on the ground still. Yes, there's a few riders in this corner. Felix Engelhardt will be abandoning for Team Lotto Destiny. Everyone else is up. No, he's not abandoning. He's just chilling on the side of the road. Great. Anyway, the peloton is in pieces. With all these crashes, Jakob Fogelsang is behind, Bob Jungels, Han van Hoeke, Dombrowski. As Tudor works on that group, Schwartzman has had a puncture from A2. Peloton is still Tudor and GW Shimano. Leon Sanchez down in front, and Wenzel is about to make his way back to the Peloton with 40 kilometers to go. Clement Davy has had his timer in the pack. He is dropping off the back now. Sanchez has been caught. Is they going to roll through Sanchez? Nope, he's maintaining with the pack. Iolo Cometa now. Happy to drive the pace. Wenzel has been caught. Looks like Colorado is dropping drop from the peloton also. St. Michael, let's have a look, shall we? St. Michael have... Jesus Harada and Deval in this front peloton of 28 riders. <laughs> the breakaway is 45 seconds, three riders out in front at Bedard, Mangonard, and Selby. It'll be about a minute back before the rest of the pack. There's Geshenard of St. Michael, he's dropped off. Little chase bunch by Ericsson. Oh, Gomez Sanchez, they're actually from the front group. August Jensen has had a crash at the back of the race, but he is back up and on his bike. There's quite a few splits here, and if you're not in the first few groups, I don't think you're going to make it back. Corbin Strong on the back of the peloton now with two Trinity riders, Harry Sweeney and Rutkin Gray. Looks like something's cooking, everyone's kind of sitting still a bit, giving a better chance to this group of five to catch back up. 
Vival of St. Michael now drops off the peloton, leaving St. Michael with just Jesus Ryder. But he's at the front in the action. Well, Ryder's dropping out the back now. Thinning out. Winslow's gone. Selby's gone. Colorado looks like he's gone. Roubaix is all gone. There's only one rider out in front. Who is it? It's Bidard from the original breakaway. There's only 14 riders left. Jesus Harada, Ruben Fernandez, Vincenzo Abonese, Altela Volta, Alessandro Cove, Ioannis Aguirre, Corbin Strong, Chris Nielens, Thibault Nice, Gianca Brambila, Pesha, Brett, and Misery. 40 seconds back is a group of seven riders here, led by Harry Sweeney, Mengadar Del Tre. Goldstein has fallen in A7, not important to the race. Peloton being driven by another big crash in the pack. Dombrowski, Wallop, Inglehit, and Sean Flynn are down. But it's just these 14 riders that are now important. Bedard's about to be caught. He has been caught by the peloton. Will he be able to hold on? That is the question. A few riders slipping back as we climb this hill. Thibaut Nice has gone from the pace making. Both riders from Flanders. Looks like Corbin Strong setting up for some bullshit reason. Attacked by Jesus, a rider Albanese on his wheel. Volta, Izegere, Kovi, and Nielens. Rambila, Pesha, and Corbin Strong are all in the chase bunch. Withdrawal by Brennan Hoitsch. The race is over for these two Flanders riders. Attack by Nealands at the front. Taken a bit by surprise. Can he get a gap though? He's getting a little bit of a gap but not enough to do any proper damage. Volta just rolls on straight past him. Better Cat and Mouse has allowed that second bunch to catch up. Better Stella is back and he is straight on the front for Kovi. Fernandez working for Izegere. Few domestics here. Nealance looks like he's the leader for Team Israel. Looks like Corbin Strong will work for him. Attack on the front, better Stella. He's setting up Volta. Different teams for some reason by taking. This is the final ascent of the whole climb. Nine kilometers to go as they go through the car of doom. There's an attack on the front by Jesus Hirona once again. St. Michael doing the carrying. Is it Gary? Everyone's straight on their wheel. No, anyone's been dropped. Yes, better Stella. Fernandez. Strong is just missing out off that back of their wheel. Seven Ks are down the descent. They've got a plateau, not really plateau, but kind of like a descent, then an ascent once again. Again by Jesus Arada, he is definitely very active this race. Nealens counters. Still kind of stand at 3k's to go. Nealens goes again. Kovi on his wheel. Is a Gary Harada is a group of four who have broken away from the group of seven. Nealens is looking dead. Unlucky Nealens. Kovi now launches. No one follows. No one follows Kovi. Ezeguera is slowly winding up to him. Harada's in his wheel. It's going to be between these three. Can Ezeguera get round? Here comes the finish line. It's Ezeguera. It's Harada. It's Kovi. Looks like it could be Harada here. Harada and Ezeguera. Jesus Harada of St. Michael Uber takes the stage ahead of Ezeguera. Everyone else follows in behind from that bunch. Corbin Strong, next best of the rest. Followed by Better Stella.
rounding out the top 10 for GW Shimano. Bob Yagel sprints against Thibaut Nice for the next major bunch that will make up the top 20. Yagel Fogelsang, the other big name in here. Mizjik, Formalo, Axel Lorenz finishes outside the top 20 for Roubaix. Here are the two at the back. Is that uh, Decock? It is Decock and Borgain. You're right. How out did easy carry? Go podium. Jesus Rada takes the sprint ahead of Ilya Zagira, Alexander Rakovi, Nilan Zavolta, Albanese, Brambila. Pesha 19 seconds back, Corbin Strong a minute and a half back. Premier Tech take the team classification. Well, thanks for tuning in for Japan Cycle Cup. Let's we're now going to start with the last race of the season. Season, Tour of Gongshi. Wait, any abandons? Yeah, there's some abandons. If that makes a difference, but... 